An inner city Lancaster neighborhood is taking on problems of grime in a unique clean sweep. News 8's Karen Jennings has our story tonight from the street where they're picking up out of pride. The people who live here in the 300 block of Beaver Street in Lancaster say they are tired of the trash, broken glass, and run-down homes. And so today, they took it upon themselves to change that, not just for themselves, but for their children. Now we can walk around, and I wouldn't be able to be stepping on nails and all this stuff. We would be able to play kickball in the alleyways without worrying about anything. Like many families on this block, the Garas do not own their home. They rent but feel an intense pride and responsibility to maintain and improve their properties. For three and a half years, Deb Guerra has worked with her landlord to convince her neighbors this is a project that could be done. I think it means that more people care than I thought. And um, they're given a chance, I think these people will do a lot more for themselves. It's wonderful. It makes me feel so proud that uh, everybody does care about this block. And today, that pride and enthusiasm spread to local politicians and businesses, which joined the act by donating their time, energy, and equipment. Ted Parson, dis uh, trash disposal, he donated his truck and his labor. J.C. Snavely was one that really supported us heavily. Um, and we have a lot of thanks to all these businesses. What you see happening here on Beaver Street is really just the beginning. As the neighbors here clean up their homes, they're also hoping to clean out bigger problems caused by drugs and crime. Obviously, the people in this neighborhood care. Um, and those who don't care probably will stay out of the neighborhood. In Lancaster, Karen Jennings, News 8. Individual landlords are planning even more improvement projects in the months ahead.